How do they truly feel about you today? We have death. Their true feelings, commitment. They are committed to the ending of everything that isn't serving. This is an ego death. They're committed to living through the heart. Living through the soul, overcoming fear, their true feelings, respect, and yeah, I'm shifting very deeply right now. This is the death of the false self, this is the death of anything holding back love this is a deep soul commitment okay you're you shook hands on it so to speak your souls agreed to go through an immense metamorphosis from the old earth to new earth from unconsciousness to consciousness from the fearful mind into the trusting knowing heart spreading you're both spreading your wings being becoming your true authentic selves being free from the struggles of the cocoon. Again, a huge metamorphosis. What the caterpillar thinks the death is a death, the butterfly, it knows its new life. So this person, you both have deep admiration for each other. You hold each other in highest, high esteem, honoring each other's needs and wishes on this deep soul level so much empathy wanting to do good by each other and fairness this is what your connection is about it's such a loving energy it's truly supportive for many of you this is harmonious obviously there's going to be triggers um, that helps with the shifting of blocks but overall i feel there's harmony and commitment and consciousness, this is a mature connection, old souls, their true feelings for you. Three of Cups, yeah, this is a complete celebration. This is reunion, the Holy Trinity, you, your person, and the soul family, or the divine. Your souls agree to experience joy, all the goodness in life. All the beauty, this this is what um, has really sparked this opening, opening to seeing deeper in life, seeing the beauty, the heaven, the joy, the love beneath everything, beneath the harshness of this world. Wow. This huge metamorphosis is being joined consciously, it just says 333, with the divine. Your person feels euphoria. There's a sun here, it's like a sunrise after the darkest night. So you may have met after huge struggles or during huge struggles in your own individual lives or you could have felt very stuck. Spirit is emphasized and you've both felt very stuck. Um, internally but there may also have been physical circumstances day-to-day -day circumstances that are highlighting how you feel within so what's going on whatever's made you or making you feel stuck um, in your day's day life is a manifestation of how you and this person have felt stuck um, internally like struggling for your true self to come out i feel like both of you have struggled with healthy boundaries or expressing your truth or sticking up for yourself or learning to say no so maybe you've been like these yes people a yes person and then saying yes to everything has sort of got you caught up in things but this is that metamorphosis of liberation and freedom 
their true feelings for you. Four of Cups. So, yeah. To me, this is really, this talks about boredom or discontent. But this is not how they feel about you. I feel this is what they were stuck in. Like stagnation or their soul was unfulfilled. You know, they were living their life like we all do until we awaken. But they were living their life like in that social matrix. We're told that looking outside of ourselves and creating all of these achievements on the outside will deeply fulfill us. And it really wasn't. This is someone that's very successful. Maybe they were in some sort of commitment, a marriage or something with this engagement ring here. Um, to me, this is like them giving their cup, them giving their heart, feeling stuck. It could literally just be they're stuck in fears or illusion, but they're still... This is them like breaking through, awareness breaking through, them opening their heart. You give this person a sense of freedom, joy, excitement, seeing everything through the beautiful eyes of love, spiritual eyes. Their soul can soar to infinite heights with you because of feeling stuck in certain ways. Death and rebirth, it's like you've connected with each other on this divine level, a truly awakening level, and it's been the death, it's become the death of their old self, their old way of living in this social matrix, their old um, things that held meaning no longer hold meaning, uh, it seems meaningless. And this is why this discontent, soul discontent or boredom or stagnation has come up. Because look, I feel this is someone else giving them their heart. If they are in a commitment, a, a relationship or a marriage, this is like someone else, their partner or anyone in their life that was more associated with their old self before awakening is giving them their heart or trying to be there for this person but look this person's looking at the three of cups here which represents this holy trinity this divine union with you and and the universe the true feelings we have the seven of swords this is that avoiding conflict energy. I feel like, yeah, this person, again, it could be mirrored with you. But this person, they're fearful of conflict or confrontation or being their true self, expressing who they really are. And I feel like it's landed them feeling stuck, being that yes person. And it's something to do with your connection, really highlighting this. So how do they truly feel about you? Memories. Memories of commitment. These two cards come, have come out together a lot in recent readings. Memories of past commitment. M memories, remembering the soul contract. You've had many past lives together. You may have been married in past lives. You may have played different roles in different lifetimes. Your souls have always been committed to being respectful towards each other and helping each other shift and grow in very, very major ways. When they met you, I feel like they weren't expecting to meet you when they did. Maybe they were engaged at the time. Maybe they just got engaged to someone else and then they literally met you and when they saw you, they remembered your soul. And it's been this absolute explosion of love and soul memories that's changed everything. 
for them and there's like no going back once you awaken you can't unsee what you now know and shift it into their true feelings i love you yeah i feel like they felt that immediately because of the memories this person it's like they feel like they can't escape their circumstances but their soul is constantly like with you <laughs> their true feelings divine timing everything's happened and is happening for a reason basically with this, both having the arrows in, I feel like there will come a time where they they will come forward and like communicate their feelings. To me, this arrow is like the Ace of Swords kind of energy, clarity. Or you just re it was the right time to me, even though it seemed like the worst time. If you look at it from a 3D level, it was like the worst time to meet, but the souls knew it was the best time, <laughs> the time you were supposed to meet for lessons, for a triggering, to bring up fears, to be released over time. It was the perfect timing. You really pierced their heart. Yeah, look at the bottom of the deck, past lives time you've known each other beyond space and time and yeah look cupid's arrow cupid strikes they remember you from past life and look another arrow coming forward joint mission destined love another arrow wow <laughs> and for some of you it could have seemed like the most uh, inconvenient time that you met, but it was to create this heartbreak, to break, to really shake this person to the core, I feel, for metamorphosis, for growth. Their true feelings. Yeah, look, profound shift, deep transformations. We had I'm um, shifting very deeply right now. Integration of the soul, awakening, healing, challenges, most definitely. Understanding, releasing density, raising vibration. Unconscious. You met in order to shift this person out of unconsciousness. Stuck in illusion, fearful, in the overactive mind, stressed, blinded, unaware, asleep, social matrix, conformity, and amnesia, but you cured that amnesia because they remembered who they really are and who you are and why they are here on earth. Study mates, yeah. You learn from each other. You work in the higher dimensions. In the higher dimensions, there's like school, there's classes where you learn from your soul family. Um, and then you've come to this earth school to play out certain agreements to learn. Act, you've activated each other to consciously realize you are here to learn. Um, soul contract, wisdom, mission, ascension, soulmates. Yeah, you met in order to help each other powerfully shift, ascend, have that huge metamorphosis coming out of the social matrix into freedom. Their true feelings. This is the love of a lifetime. I, I just keep laughing. I mean, it isn't funny, but it's like they instantly recognized your soul. They instantly remembered you, but they were already in some sort of commitment. 
and it just see it seems ironic to the the mind but the universe brought you together at the perfect time their true feelings I have so much fear right now. Yeah, I'm not surprised with the circumstances here. It You met, look, this is a lightning bolt. I have so much fear the lightning bolt has shattered through the illusion of love or the illusion of some sort of commitment they were already in. Um, breaking their heart open to like true love and who they really are and they feel so drawn to you this is drawing them into awakening so i'm going to continue this reading on in an extended reading we're going to look even deeper into their true feelings we're going to look at lots of messages cards as well what would they say to you right now about how they really feel what do they need you to know and what is going to unfold between you both um, from now onwards as well so the details for the extended reading are below this video in the description box and in the pinned comment so i really hope to see you over there if this reading has resonated with you please let me know in the comments give it a thumbs up share it subscribe that will really helps me out with the algorithm thank you so much for joining me here and i hope to see you over on the extended